This is our long-awaited video update for the Rockland County Journal Digital, The Edward Hopper Years, which is sponsored by the Nyack Library. This is the reel that your funds, contributed via Kickstarter, will help us to digitize. Once we get our funding, we will send this reel to Hudson Microimaging in Port Ewan, New York. Last week, I made a trip upstate to check on the progress and report back on how our newspaper journeys from a microfilm reel to an online full-text searchable database. The microfilm is scanned and digital files are created from those scans. The digital files then go through four levels of quality control, which check the image quality for the appropriate focus or any other distortions which would create a need for the image to be rescanned. The dates of the issues and the page numbers are checked and the files are renamed in sequential order. These images are imported into DocWorks software that automatically recognizes headlines, advertisements, and provides OCR, which stands for Optical Character Recognition. This DocWorks software, along with the check of its work by people like Adam at Hudson Microimaging, allows the scans of the newspaper to be translated into a language which can be used in an online full-text searchable database on the internet like news.hrvh.org. Once this process is complete, the files are sent to Southeastern New York Library Resources Council in Highland, New York. Zachary Spalding uploads the files to the server and then re-indexes the entire database in a process which sometimes can take 12 to 16 hours, depending on the total amount of data being added to the site. We hope this video has given our backers and the general public a better idea of how the process of digitization works. We have less than 30 days left for our project to be completed. All donations must be made by April 22nd at 6 p.m. We hope you will make a contribution.